Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to use the camera or any of the video MP4 to create the motion capture. And this is really amazing. You can see these two display picture. These are videos. It is going to capture the motion, the mocap, and send it to Icon 7, make it become an iMotion file or RL motion file. So start from now, I'm going to show you step by step. First, you have to scroll down, go to my video description, go and download the 3D post tracker. This is the official site or you can use my alternative dow download link. This is my Google Drive. It, it is the same. Go and download the zip file. After you download the zip file and you extract it, you will get this folder. Something like this. This is a software we call 3D Post Tracker. Double click and open. Now you have to open the 3D Post Tracker EXE file. It is really awesome and really easy. Now it is loading. Next, what you are going to do is you can either use your webcam or just use a movie file. As demo, I will just use a movie file. You can see now I have a Tai Chi video file. I want to perform a video. I want to perform a motion capture or mockup by using this video. By using this software, I will, I will click load movie from my desktop and I double click this video. And I will click record. BBH once I can see the video. Right again, I load the movie, I double click this. It is not loading, wait for a while. Alright, now I use another video. This is the, the original one. Alright, I'm going to use this. I load again. Load the movie. The Tai Chi video already. And then, once it loads already, I'm going to click record the BBH. This one not yet starts. And here also not yet starts. Once it starts to have here, I click record the BBH. Now it is recording. And I just wait for a while to just record a few frames here. Now it has some of the motion that's under recording so the first round is is the video have arrows now i, I try the i try this video everything will be okay this is a mp4 format video or you can use your camera your, your webcam to record as well and now i'm going to stop recording save it on my desktop it is a bvh file i would name it as tai chi then so I save on my desktop, I click save. And now you can see the BVH file is here. Now I can close this already. Next step, what we are going to do is just go and download the third link that I provided in the video description. The 3D post tracker.iavata. This is for iCloud 7. So you Open your Icon 3D Exchange 7 and next you drag in drag in the I avatar that downloaded from here. This is the I avatar. Now I'm going to drag in drag in on it. And then here you have to scroll down to find the motion library. Drag in the BVH file just now. Drag in, choose current character and click convert. Then click add all to perform and then click here to export. To export it, 
you have to unpick the export geometry and only pick export animations and tick here as demo I will browse my desktop and I will export the RL motions on my desktop I click OK and click OK now it is exporting as the RL motions this is the ones alright next we may test the RL motions in iClone 7 in your iClone 7 just drag in any of the avatar I choose from here for example I will choose the CC avatar Christian I drag it out I drag him out and maybe I will try at the G6 avatar as well I will try at Heidi now I have two avatar I press here to make it at the center next this is the RL motion the motion capture just now it is ready drag into the guy drag into the girl now we can just have a look we play now you can see it have the motion capture just now and everything look okay this is exactly the Tai Chi motion capture just now right of course you can always adjust the speed in order to adjust the motion speed you can just click here now you can see this is the, the timeline if you already select select it if you double click you can see let's say this guy I click here to fit to the window fit to the window and then this is the motions if I want to change the speed I can just right click here set the speed for example this speed is is 100% if I want to make it fast I can change it to become 200 it will double the speed and now I apply All right so you can see this is the the number of frame the total frame is 1800 I may just go to the preferences here under the project the total frame I added to become 3000 for example now I can see this is the maximum I have 3000 here I fit it again fit to window now this is the total frame the total frame of the project if I double click Heidi you can see now it have different speeds the Christian here already changed the speed it will, here will be faster and now Heidi will be slower because I changed the speeds of course I can make make him become slower as well I double click it under the motions here I right click set the speeds I make it become 50 then now Christian will be much slower just have a look now he's really extremely slow and Heidi dance with normal speed all right that's all for today about how to hack the motion capture the mocap by using a camera or any of the mp4 video and it is really free for your iCron 7 you can capture any of your dancing and even your martial arts any of the motions you can perform any of the mocap by using these AI apps and send it to iCron 7 to create your 3D animations make it become any of the RL motion or iMotion in your iCron 7 and that's all for today thank you for watching if you love my video tutorial, if you feel all these tutorials are very helpful to your 3D animation and game developing, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time I publish a new video tutorial, you receive a notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy, happy animation and game developing. See you.